Hi everybody, I'm Lori Rudiman and I'm here with Chris Dunn and we are going to speak at a conference called Talent Success, which is in September in Napa Valley, sponsored by Clear Company. And so Chris, what do you want to talk about? We're doing this awesome video. What's on your mind? So uh, let's talk about things we've learned when we've presented this in the past, okay? The, the biggest thing I've learned is like everybody, when they, when they hear about the model, the first thing they want to do is figure out who, who they are, which one of the nine faces are they. The second one thing they want to do is they want to figure out who are the people they love in HR and who are the people that they hate in HR. What, what are those faces? But like, as we've done this a couple of times, Lori, the biggest thing I've learned is that everybody wants to move to highest ability to innovate, drive change and add value. We've got this one persona called the judge, senior level leader, high rules, high control, a lot of people don't want to be that, but in talking to people that are looking for HR leaders, talking to different companies and in different industries, you know, sometimes you need that person. Sometimes that's the best person to like lead an HR team. Now they may be stifling this hat to the millennials that try and work as part of their, their functional area, but sometimes you need that person. So I think it's like, don't assume with the nine faces of HR that the ones that are maybe the most sexy are the ones that are the best fit for every job because that's simply not true. Yeah, I love it. You know, when I think about the nine faces of HR, the contrarian in me, the cynical girl in me, mm -hmm. wants to say, you can't slap a label on this. What do you know, Chris Dunn? And what do you know, right. Larry Rudiman? Which is actually kind of legit. But what do you know about psychology? I don't deserve any of these faces. And you know, as I listen to it, and Chris, as we've worked on this model, I fit in there. I fit in there absolutely. So I know there will be people in the audience in Napa who are like, you can't label me, and you're right. But if you listen long enough, if you lean into the model, right, if you just kind of open your ears, there's something in there for you. There is a word, a description that nails who you are and will help you, you, Krista, get to the next level in your career. Yeah, I. I was a skeptic, you remember that, but now I'm yes. a believer, the nine faces, it's truth. All right, so are you excited to speak in Napa? I'm excited, it's all about self-awareness. I'm gonna be self-aware when I'm on the stage and we want everybody else to be self-aware when they hear about the nine faces of HR. I can't wait to be there. Me too. All right, everybody, it is September 27th through 29th. If you wanna follow us on Twitter, the hashtag is CCTSC16, write that down, please, please, Chris, we're supposed to be on Twitter. And everybody, we will see you in Napa with some bubbly and some vino. Bye.